On May 25th, Ireland will vote on whether or not to lift the nation's Eighth Amendment, which guarantees the right of life to both the mother and the child. Unfortunately, a popular band used their platform recently to encourage Irish voters to support abortion. The Irish rock band U2 wrote on Twitter last week, vote on May 25th, and included a repeal the eighth picture. Repealing the Eighth Amendment would mean allowing unrestricted access to abortion for the first three months of pregnancy in Ireland. This U2 message immediately faced pro-life pushback. Pro-life advocate Obianuju Ekiocha tweeted out a video of lead singer Bono talking about how it's important people have the right to live. Ekiocha pointed out the hypocrisy, writing, Dear Bono, you talk about the right to live, so good to hear that. But then you two spat on the right to life of the most innocent. Why? Chris Stefanik, whom EWTN viewers will recognize from Real Life Catholic, also had a powerful response, tweeting back to you two, you've turned your back on your Irish Catholic people fighting for a culture of life and human dignity at the most fundamental level. Let's all pray for the Emerald Isle, that voters will continue to recognize the inherent dignity of the unborn, and that Ireland can be a light for the rest of the world. St. Patrick, pray for us.